my name is Belinda Purdom. I'm with Utah Film Awards, and we're here at CBX Live, and I'm talking right now with Will Hobson mm -hmm. with... Um, what was the production company in? It's Willwood Productions. Willwood Productions. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And tell us a little bit about your production company. Sure. Um, so we just recently started Willwood Productions. Uh, it came about as a, a result of us actually making our first film. Okay. Yeah. And is that the film that you're here? Yeah. Okay. Tell yeah, us a little bit about so, that. So my film's not been submitted yet. We're in uh, post-production. Uh, so the film's called The Light Express. It's a modern musical fantasy. Um, and it's uh, we, filmed, we filmed it in February. So we're just in post right now. Oh, okay, yeah, that's yeah. exciting. Yeah. I just hearing modern musical fantasy yeah. already <laughs> has me interested. <laughs> yeah. um, can I ask more about that without giving too much away? Sure, sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Just tell tell me more what that means. Sure. So, the Light Express. Um, it's it's about uh, a group of ten people who board a train. Okay. And um, they're, they they gain admittance from the engineer. And so after they board this train. They they fall asleep and then when they wake up next thing they know they're babies. Okay. So the engineer. Um, so what this is is it's a train ride through life and that's our log line. Okay. And so these people are experiencing their lives and the engineer's with them the whole time. Um, nobody knows he's there except for him obviously. Okay. And uh, it's 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 a not religious but quite spiritual film. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. and, but it's a musical also. It is. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the music was written by Carol Cobb, probably one of the best composers that's that's in Utah. Period. Okay. Um, no, nobody really knows him, but uh, we're we're hoping to change that for him. So. Okay, that's great. <laughs> I'm excited to yeah. to hear the music. Yeah. And um, your producer or director? P producer. I'm producer. Okay. Yeah, yeah and, and I, I also acted in the film. Um, okay. So I do have a role in there. Okay. Um, but yeah, cool. I'm, I'm producer. Do you just show up? Do you have a cameo, or do you actually? No, I've actually got a part. I'm oh, there cool. for the whole thing. So. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then, how did this I the idea for this film come about? Well, actually, this film was written quite a while ago, um, probably close to 30 years. Um, and uh, so, what happened was the writer was trying to produce a stage play, okay. and uh, her partner had dropped out on her, so she needed to have somebody to write the music ASAP. So the music for this was actually written in one week and recorded within that same week. Wow. And uh, so so it was written as a stage play probably 30 years ago. And okay. uh, despite all that, it still remains a modern show. In it's fact, it's probably more modern now than it was when it was written. Interesting. <laughs> I, yeah, and I guess the themes, I mean, traveling through life, right. you know, experiencing things like that is... Um, Pretty universal theme. Yeah. So, um, and that's that's interesting too. Is the whole film contained within one train, mm -hmm. um, in one car, or or all, no, all no, different? No, no. It's uh, well, it's so you actually experience the film from two different perspectives. So okay. you get the engineer, and and you're going to see him from inside the train, and kind of what he's he's seeing the okay. the passengers as. But the passengers will actually be living in a modern world, experiencing real lives. But it's, okay. it's it's a small cast of ten people, so they're always interacting with each other. But it's okay. it's they're in a modern world. So. Okay. Cool. <laughs> yeah. And um, how did you become involved um, with the writers? Sure. Um, so the writer actually was doing some stage work down in uh, Southern Utah, down in Hurricane, and uh, I I had auditioned for some plays and stuff with her. And uh, what happened was, you know, I started looking at some of her scripts. And this is one that we hadn't done together, but uh, we decided that it would be a perfect first film. Um, and uh, ever since then, it's just been rock and roll. I mean, cool. within two months, we were shooting the film, and now we're in post-production. Wow, so, okay. It's yeah. just, that's cool. I, yeah. I like it when things really just happen mm -hmm. like that. Um, yeah. Real quick, where can they find uh, more about this? So uh, we have www.thelightexpress.com, and we also have our Facebook page, The Light Express. Okay, cool. Well, we're out of time. Thanks so much okay. for speaking with us. Yeah. <laughs> and have fun at the convention. Perfect. Thank you. <laughs>